Hello friends, I am here Kripa Shankar once again with you. We would like to inform you that the content on studentsrunway.com is exclusively compiled for distribution solely on studentsrunway.com. You may use the content for personal learning or pass it on to your friends, but please do not use it for any commercial or institutional use without acquiring prior authorization. Any tampering of watermarks of studentsrunway.com or Krupa coaching is liable for legal action. This is Krupa signing off. Thank you very much. All the best. Here in this picture, you are seeing <coughs> the statue of Jesus Christ. And what we are interested in discussing is the word altar. A-L-T-A-R. An altar is a raised platform where sacrifices uh, or oblations O B L A T I O N oblation oblation simply means an offering of a sacrifice so an altar is a place where oblations are offered it's a raised platform an altar is a raised platform now here in this every church you have this kind of a chapel C H A P E L a chapel is a place of Christian worship and uh, actually chapel is subordinate to and smaller than a church but a chapel uh, can also mean in every church there is a room or a recess set apart for special services and it has an altar it has its own altar that is why this is a chapel which has an altar and uh, on this altar you can see votive candles v o t i v e now votive means uh, something that is done a votive simply means promised votary v o t a r y v o t a r y votary means a person bound by a vow or promise or who has undertaken some kind of a religious vow you see people go to shabarimala every year so they are votaries of Ayappa, a person devoted to a particular religion, uh, a devout worshipper. A devout worshipper can be called a votary. Now these are votive candles, V-O-T-I-V-E, -E, votive candle. So a candle used as a vigil light in the church, placed on the altar, that's called a votive candle. It is used as a votive candle, means a candle used as a vigil light. Now what's a vigil? V I G I L. Vigil simply means a watch, wakefulness, staying awake. <clears throat> this is another picture of an altar. You can see a raised platform. Some things have been offered there. This is another piece of a picture, uh, another uh, p p picture of uh, the altar and the altar piece as well. A L T A R P I E C E. Altar piece. Now, altarpiece simply means an ornamental carving or painting above an altar. So, there is a very beautiful altarpiece here. This is simply another picture of an altarpiece. Now, this two polar bears are having a heated altercation. A-L-T-E-R-C-A-T-I-O-N. Altercation is an angry or heated argument, a wrangle. A, a squirrel, a squabble, S Q U A B B L A, a wrangle, W R A N G L E, W R A N G L E, quarrel angrily, noisily, dispute, altercation, a controversy, disagreement. These are synonyms. This is an alto saxophone, A L T O. Alto is the range of voice which is very high between tenor and mezzo-soprano, mezzo tenor and mezzo-soprano. Mezzo <coughs> well, uh, we, we will be discussing all these words in greater detail. As you know, alto is the highest uh, male pitch. Uh, tenor is slightly below that. Mezzo-soprano means the mid-range. And this instrument is a saxophone, S-A-X-O-P-H-O-N-E. -E. Well, the picture itself has this word. A saxophone is saxophone is a woodwind instrument. It has a metal body, 
and uh, that's it this is an alto saxophone you are also seeing the word metal ligature ligature is l i g a t u r e ligature means tying or binding together a link or connection a thing used to tie or bind together that's a ligature so remember ligature simply means a link a connection these kids are amassing collecting a m a s s pile up gather collect it together accumulate hoard h o a r d we are interested in this word hoard that's an important one hoard h o a r d means keeping a supply in a hidden uh, area or kept in reserve secretly stored secreted s e s e c r e t e that is to secrete means to keep in a secret place seclude conceal so these kids are amassing or rather simply collecting all the uh, plastic bags or maybe it looks like they're just gathering all the garbage that's available amass this is a picture of the amazon rainforest a m a z o n the amazon rainforest in south america of course you remember the word amazon means a female warrior a, a woman athlete amazons in ancient days were known to be women who belong to a particular tribe and who were warriors now this is the amazon a warrior woman this is the picture of amber a m b e r amber is a yellow or brownish yellow resin uh, used in jewelry that's amber so you can easily remember amber is yellowish golden yellowish or brownish yellow it's a kind of resin used in jewelry resin is a, a resin is something like a gum a semi solid viscous uh usually translucent substance that's a gum g u m hello friends kripa shankar here again with you we thank you for your interest in kripa coaching and studentsonway.com if you find our content useful please like us on facebook follow us on twitter and uh, subscribe to our youtube channel and hope we hope you give us a plus 1 on google you can also subscribe to our email list and be notified upon new updates thank you this is krupa shankar signing off good luck